hi my beautiful kings and queens so welcome back to my channel as you all know i am your girl latroya griffin and as i always say don't forget to like comment and subscribe and don't forget to turn on your notification bell so that you can be notified anytime and every time your girl uploads a new video so my kings and queens i'm going to go ahead and jump straight into today's word so john 3 Verse 20 says, For everyone who does wicked things hates the light and does not come to the light, lest his works be exposed. So God is saying, Everyone who does wicked things hates the light and does not come to the light, lest his works should be exposed. So God is saying, I hear I hear the Lord saying, there are a few people that are still doing evil things or still not doing the things of God because they feel more comfortable with with being on the enemy side. But God is saying that it's time for you to come over to his kingdom. It's time for you to repent. I hear the Lord is saying, I hear the Lord saying, it's never too late to come to the light. He knows your weaknesses, but he still loves you. He knows your limitation, but he still chose you for the job. He knows that the flesh is weak, but he's still, he's still there for you in the midst of your troubles. So before the end of the year is over, I hear God calling some of his people to his kingdom. God is saying he knows everything that you are going through. He knows your struggles. He knows your, your limitation. He's no, he knows your doubts he knows your insecurities but he is still calling you to his kingdom because he has already predestined your life god is saying he knew everything that was going to come about in your life before he even formed you but he still called you to his kingdom he still wants you to come into his kingdom because he has planned out your life because he has a plan for your life he's still calling your name so my kings and queens, if God is calling you to his kingdom, if he is telling you and revealing things to you that that no other man or no other person in your family is really, you know, experiencing his revelation like you like you are. God is saying that he's calling you. He's saying he's calling you out the crowd. He's calling you from from the crowd because you are different. You are different because he ordained you. He predestined you. So God is saying he is calling you from the midst of the of the of the enemy. So in this season, I hear the Lord saying that he is about to reveal some things to you. He's about to about to expose people's true colors. He is about to expose the your your bad so that he can bring you to your new your new creation. God is saying that he is about to rebirth you. I hear the Lord saying that a, a rebirthing is about to take place in this kingdom. So my kings and queens, if God is calling you. If he is telling you that it's time for you to turn your life over to him, I advise you to do so right now in this season. Before we start the new year, I hear the Lord calling some of his people to his kingdom. You have been dipping and dabbing in the enemy's pool for long enough. God is calling you to his kingdom. So I love you all so much and I will be uploading another video later on. So know that the Lord has predestined you. You're different. You were created to be different and it's okay to be different. So I love you all so much and I will be seeing you all later. Bye.